Okay, so before we get today's video started, I want to let you guys know that we are currently moving. Scooter Zone is moving warehouses. We're going from Temecula in our massive warehouse that we seriously don't need anymore to something a little bit smaller in Marietta. And uh, we're going to have a moving sale. Cruise into the shop, and if you guys mention the moving sale, you guys are going to get 15% off your entire order. Okay, so 15% off. This is going from today all the way until April 25th. So be on the lookout. Cruise in if you need some new wheels. Cruise in and save some money. 15% off. It's not a bad thing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and uh, enjoy. Can you do scooter tricks? Yeah, let me see. Not that good. That's okay. Let me see what you got. Just hawks a flare, bro. It just hits the spine. Three is the spine. <laughs> <laughs> We're like, video's over. We're going home. And this kid's sponsored now. Okay, so we're over here at Scooter Zone right now and I just found a picture of a spine at the skate park that I probably haven't been to in like, <sighs> Jesus, five years, maybe more, six years and there's this spine there that is absolutely ridiculous. Like there's no reason this spine should be one this big and you're two this sketchy or steep. So I found a photo of it. I'm going to put it right here on the screen and we're gonna cruise over and I'm going to show AJ and Garrett the spine, get their actual reaction because I think that we're going there today, I think. Hey, how much? How much what? How much to hit one specific ramp that I have on my phone right now? Can I see it first? Why? <laughs> 500 minimum. Minimal? <gasps> it's ridiculous, that is minimal. dude. That's vert, dude. For like it's a vert spine. It doesn't look that big on the phone now that I look at it right now, but that thing is massive. And you can tell how steep it is, dude. It's just straight it's up. How steep it is on a camera, you know it's gnarly. Gnarly. I've never jumped it. I've seen it in person, but I haven't ever actually even like rolled up to it. I don't even know if there's a roll up to it at all. And if there's not, this video is just going to be a video of us showing it. <laughs> Yo, honestly, I might need a number because I don't think I really want to even jump this thing. And if, I, if we do go and it's as vert as it looks like it is, because like I said, I don't really remember because I've never really actually looked at it. I've ridden like this little roller thing that's right next to it, done a couple of flip tricks and things like that. But if this thing's as big as it looks as it, like it is on the phone, I might be down to like roll up to it and like kind of do like one of those things and like just roll over the spine but i'm not jumping it let's just clarify that i'm not jumping it okay okay it is a 54 minute drive and it is currently 255 so we'll be getting there right at about four so to harada skate park we go don't toss that in <laughs> those are expensive Ready? so so go deck deck on my bars like that no turn it 90 degrees no what go back 90 degrees there you go. Ah. Success. <laughs> Where are my knee pads? Oh, right here. My trunk is a damn mess. Ah, oh, quick shouts out to the sponsors. S1 who makes the best pads for the skate park and of course helmets if you guys need to grab one of these cruise over to your local s1 dealer and get one and of course envy scooters shouts out to my my boys over there i've been riding this this scoop for a little while now riding the aos v5 deck of course got the uh declare v2 forks the new deluxe wheels this one's a little bent though that's my bad omen scs titanium bars which these bars have been pretty pretty solid so far so shouts out to those guys for hooking it up Keep my scoop fresh all the time. Where can you get new stuff? www.thescooterzone.com. If you guys need to grab anything, cruise over there. Link will be in the description below. And of course, the link. Well, not the link, the URL. Go buy your scooters there. Thanks. Anyways, we got over here at the skate park and there's kids running around in there. So we don't know how this is gonna go yet. Parkour. All right, so we made it inside the skate park. <laughs> AJ's trying to learn how to 180 right now. You can't really tell, to be honest with you, but this is the spine. It's not quite as tall as I remember it being, but it's probably like a seven and a half foot tall vert spine. And AJ said he's gonna hit it. <laughs> Look at this thing though. We're gonna, we're gonna come back to it. We're not gonna really hit it right now. It's so ridiculous. I really don't even wanna jump it. I just wanna do the rollover thing and I'm cool. Like nobody actually jumps this thing except for like Ryan Nyquist. I heard years ago that he backflip bar spin this. That's a rumor. I don't know if it's true or not. Ryan, if you're watching, please let us know. It reminds me of a, a larger version of the feast spine. Yo, does this guy not know I'm trying to film YouTube videos right now, though? 
Come on, my audio, bro. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Harada Skate Park. It's about an hour away from where I'm at, but it's a pretty chill little park. It doesn't have anything that's too wild, really. Like it's not a park that we would normally travel an hour or two to come and have like a serious session, but it's somewhere that we can go to kind of hang out. It's got a couple of really cool bowls over here. It's got this bowl over here, which is actually really good for people to learn how to drop in on because it has this little ledge around the entire thing. So if you're trying to learn how to drop in on a skateboard in particular, that's a good spot to learn it. It's got that middle bowl over there that's actually a pretty sick little bowl. It's a little bit steep. The transit is just a little bit steep and it's got this kind of extension that you can stall and have a good time on, but that's a chill little spot. You've got this little roller spine here that's actually really cool. Um, AJ hates jumping spines, but he can do this one. It's a little whip invert and a little flat rail right after. You've got this center bowl right here, which is Again, like I, I remember it being a lot bigger. Maybe it's because I haven't been here in so long. I, I think I said the last time I was here was like five or six years ago, but I think it was a little bit further back than that. I think I was like, shoot, it might've been like almost 10 years ago. Damn, I'm getting old. This is probably about, I don't know, I'd say like an, uh, probably like an eight foot deep bowl. You've got this another little roller kind of spine boob thing right here. Some parts of the park are pretty tall, like this quarter right here. This is probably, it's probably about a 10 foot quarter or so. It's nothing, nothing small. <laughs> And then of course you have the mega spine for whatever reason. I don't know who decided this was a good idea. Someone just hit a home run. Shouts out to the kid. I don't know what skate park architect thought this was a good idea, but it is not. <laughs> it's so sketch. But hey, we're here to have a good time. Let's mess around on this little spine right here for a little bit. AJ, spine thing sesh. Could you tail up it? Could you tail up, land in the stall and then drop in? Hey, you could do like this. But well, one tail whip, not two. Yeah, there you go. AJ doesn't like doing tricks over things, so we're, we're giving him the giving him easier tasks right now. All right, let's warm up a little bit. Let's get a uh, 360 bar going that way, and we'll turn around and we'll get a. Uh, I actually haven't done a bar Indy in a while, so we'll try that. What was the first trick I said? Was it 360? Bar. Okay, thank goodness. Thanks for AJ for listening. All right, 360 bar spin. We'll hit a little back lip. AJ's coming back with a nice little. Oh God, that was so scary. Bar spin Indy. That's an old school trick, bro. None of you new era kids know about that. Shouts out to Anthony Bustos, AKA Twan. That's a Twan trick. And hey, let me get a little boost on there. Let me see it. Come on, get some speed. Let me get a boost. Hey, it's just getting better at this thing, bro. <clears throat> oh yeah, I needed that to get out. I've been holding on to that since the car ride. All right, let's get another quick warm up trick. We'll do a quad whip going that way and we'll whip bar coming back. Parkour. Oh, the knees. Oh, not the knee slides, dude. <laughs> oh. You need some of these, bro. <laughs> he does not know. I just told, I just spoke in some crazy language. He just looked at me like, that guy's weird. I gotta wait for this kid because he's gonna turn around and come right back up the other way. What can I say? That, it's almost like I've been here before. We're cool. Oh, oh. dude, no, the knee slide, bro. You need some knee pads for that, bro. You're gonna hurt yourself, homie. That hurts my knees just watching. All right, man, I'm gonna do this trick for you, okay? Air knuckles. Air knuckles. Yeah. <laughs> my man. All right, quad whip first for the little homie. And with the front board. And let's turn around and get that whip bar. Should be a first try one. Whip bar. Thing. Wait, hang on. Come on, son. You see that? That was for you, bro. What's your name? DJ. DJ? Oh, man, DJ. What do you want? Fing it? Yeah. And then what? Fing it. Go in there. Three whip back. Okay. Can I throw up there and then fing back? Because I'd be spinning into the ledge if I came back. Oh, yeah. Okay. So three whip, finger whip. All right. AJ wants a quick 360 whip. Now he wants finger up going back. We uh, we do heel fingers naturally, so that's what we're doing. Gobble, gobble. Can you do scooter tricks? Yeah, let me see. Not that good. That's okay, let me see what you got. I can just go up. That's all right, let me see. DJ is about to show us what's good. Tell you, bro, go for it. There you go. Good job, dude. Let me uh, see, DJ, what else you got, bro? Just hawks a flare, bro. It just hits the spine. Threes the spine. <laughs> <laughs> like, video's over. We're going home. And this kid's sponsored now. He takes your job. You want a pro contract, bro? I'm just gonna give you Scooter Zone. There you go. <laughs> my man, good stuff, DJ. My guy, Backy, and then Scooby coming back. Scooby? You don't even know what that is. You too young for that, you're just a child. I got a beard, buddy. I got a beard. I got a mustache. I got a beard. <laughs> I got a mustache. Beard, with a B. Stash. That's a bustache. <laughs> you want me back with that for you? My guy, let me get some. Let's go. He knows the shakes, bro. All right, backy for our boy DJ. All right, for our boy DJ, we gotta get that backy first, and we gotta come back, and we got a Scooby coming back. The backy's not so bad on that thing. I haven't done a Scooby in so long. I really hope this works. I should probably get a little extra pop on it. Bro, that was sick. 
<laughs> you ever never seen that one? Uh -uh. Oh, dude, it's a Scooby, bro. You want to try one? No. Uh -uh. You have to do it on that, dude, on the playout spot. Yeah, it's like a turn down over grab. Bro, the Ice Cream Man truck song is going to be, that's going to be the audio of this entire video. Yo, I'm gonna get you sponsored by the Ice Cream Man. What a sponsor that would be. Yo, Ice Cream Man, please hit me up. Whoa, DJ, you scared the crap out of me, bro. Popped out of freaking nowhere, bro. He just morphed into a person. He just spawned. Yo, we got another scooter, homie. My man. Hey. What up, dude? What Mike, up? what up? Are you actually the guy? The guy. The guy. From YouTube? I'm maybe He's on TV, bro. I'm on TV, homie. Give me I some. know those gloves. Come on, son. Yeah, you know, I know the gloves. You know where you get these at? Uh Lakers. Shoot, I forget. Oh, you would have, that would have been such a plug right there, filming? bro. Yeah, I'm filming. Let's go. My friends are never Where are we going? Uh, I don't know. You said let's go. Where are we going? Yo, we got the Crocs. You, sir? Oh, you in sport mode? <laughs> Show me, huh? you in sport mode? Yeah. Of course he's in sport mode. He's going to be like DJ just spawning. Yo, DJ, you spawning, bro. <laughs> Yo, DJ is AJ's spirit animal. <laughs> That's not a Scooby, bro. I mean, it was cool, but I want a Scooby. Yo, DJ matches your scooter. Purple and the blue. Come on, bro. <laughs> you guys are the same person. Yo, DJ, stand next to him really quick, bro. He's scared of you, bro. Oh, he just jumped. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you jumped down. You just, he said. <laughs> He's the only one that did proper. Oh, that's a little right. cool little fly out yeah, thing. I didn't even realize it was there. That's kind of chill. I don't know if I can front scoot out of that. I don't think I can. I can front scoot out of that. So I was gotta come off for the front scoot. I don't know if I can get the pull on the front scoot right now because of my chest, but we'll see. Yo, I wish my titty was still in one piece. That'd be pretty chill. I got three got titties. Three. I got triple titty. Try titty right now. Ledge! <laughs> Let's throw a little bed down. First try back scoot. If I land it, you buy me a Red Bull on the way home or a drink of some kind. If I don't, I buy you a drink. No! I just like tumbled. I'm, I'm gonna get back later. We're gonna get another bet. Ah, oh, son. Oh, dude, I really don't want to do this spine. <laughs> I really don't want to do it. Uh, let's just take a peek at it really quick. See what we're working with here. Normally, spines are that tall. We are much taller. Once you get the first one out of the way, it'll be fine. But that first one's spooky. Oh, dude. <laughs> I don't know if I can get flat like that, bro. I might have to go at an angle. Let me just stall it really quick. It's freaking tall, bro. <laughs> Who makes a spine that tall, bro? I don't even feel comfortable doing that. No, not even a little bit. First try, stall it and go, just do it. Yeah. I got you those Cinnabons from uh, Wings. Oh, those Cinnabites? All right, I'm down for that. Two more run-ups. Two more run-ups? Yeah. Okay. I'm scared, bro. <laughs> Let me find out the right spot to go to. It's so steep, bro. <laughs> Who makes a spine this steep? Every time I have a GoPro on, I look at my shadow and I just look like a Teletubby. <laughs> Every time I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Whatever the noises that they make are, you guys don't even. These people don't even know what Teletubbies are, dude. Oh, you ain't make you ain't making up that one, bro. You couldn't make it up this one. I don't want to do this, bro. I'm like actually not excited. Yeah, I'm not excited. I just want to roll over it, but it's freaking scary. Oh, I almost didn't make it over, dude. <laughs> I almost didn't make it up, bro. I was gonna fall backwards, dude. <laughs> it's over. It's <laughs> we're done, dude. Screw that. That thing's spooky, bro. I mean, like I could probably do it again, no problem. But like, that was scary. That was sketch. For the people that jump that thing, you guys are gnarly, dude. I'm not doing that. I'll stick to megas and vert ramps. I will stick to that happily. I would much rather ride a vert ramp or a mega over that. Okay, so we just finished up getting a quick clip over there on the little mini spine thing. Uh, it was a pretty chill little clip. I uh, posted it on the gram if you guys want to check it out. A successful session over here over at Harada Skate Park. Shouts out to AJ for cruising through with us. AJ, say hello to everybody, even though we've already done it before. Smiles. I don't know if they could see you or not, but we're going to cruise over. We're going to grab some food, AJ and I are. And then uh, after that, we're going to cruise to the house and give you guys a uh, positive message of the day because I've missed the last few. So positive message coming for you guys right now. Let's get it. 
So today's positive message is more of a positive challenge for you guys. Um, with, with the direction that the world's going and so many things going online and so many people constantly checking their social media, there's no slowing that down. But a lot of people utilize that tool that social media actually is for a lot of negativity. They do it to judge other people. And a lot of people really take that personally and, and, it, and it hurts a lot of people, it makes them kind of go in a, a sometimes a really downhill direction and the the challenge that I want to give you guys today is to go online and go to maybe just five people that you don't know and just comment something positive to them whether it's hey I like your hairstyle hey great 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 picture um, if it's somebody that's riding a scooter and you don't know these guys just be like hey that was a solid clip I loved that clip or just something that's positive for somebody that maybe they'll they'll see that comment they'll read it and let's say hey thank you we've all had terrible days and we all understand that feeling of being so low and understanding that if if we just had somebody say just something small just something small and kind that just notices something that maybe we gave a little bit of effort into we understand that that can really turn around our day and uh, can just put a smile on somebody's face maybe when they need it but that's today's positive message of the day thank you guys so much for watching today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed it um, I do have another video coming out this Friday so be on the lookout for that and uh, appreciate you guys watching love you guys later